Yo, welcome back to another video. I got my boy. Got the little the quarantine cut, you know. He got the nice cut. I gave him. I gave my my boy and my son. I got my dog. I gave my dog a little, you know, little quarantine cut. Got a match. Yeah. Hit him with it one more time, man. You know. Oh. Kind of. Kind of um. Little incident happened, but. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. It's all good. I got I gave him a little fresh cut. It's all good. Alright, let's get on to the video. Alright, alright. So what we're gonna be doing today is we're gonna pimp out my rig, you know. That's what we're gonna be doing. And don't worry about that. I just a little. They're the same brand, so I just had to you know, leave them in there. I'll mention the the headset I used is that. Um, but so we're gonna pimp, pimp. We're gonna pimp out my rig. Basically, what that means is we're gonna upgrade my computer. Today we're gonna be focusing on memory and storage. So like SSD and memory. They're basically like memory for our computer. And yeah, so let's go. I already know what these are, by the way. So we got our HyperX Fury SSD, 240 gigabytes. You know, this is basically makes our it makes our computer 12 times faster, and it's a solid state drive, more faster than a hard drive, which is already in our computer. And we have. HyperX DDR4 memory basically it's bytes and it's 3400 megahertz speed pretty fast basically normal speed and our com my computer only supports one more because it already has one it's 8 gigabytes that's already in there and then the hard drive which this is basically make it fa much more faster and make the performance a little bit better so yeah let's I don't know if it's focusing or not Yeah, there's a memory and here's the SSD. Nice here SSD from HyperX. So yeah, let's go. So I got my PC here, it's my PC. You know, it's pretty pretty new, got it like three years ago I think. And here's the specs, it's Windows 10, 64-bit, 7th generation Intel Core, Core, Intel Core i5 processor. 1 terabyte hard drive. 1 terabyte hard drive, 8 gigabytes of DDR memory, DVD readable drive, card reader. And yeah, so let's open it up. I'm delighted. <coughs> All right, so first I'm just gonna take the side screws off so I can be able to take. So I could be able to. Really? All right, so I finally got the side panel off. It took a while. Ooh, this boy dusty. A little dust came off of that. Let's set it right here. Ooh, that's so dusty. Hopefully I could slide. Hopefully I could slide the D. Holy. Alright. So we got it open. This is how it looks like. It's pretty cool. Here's the back side. Let's get this out of here. Holy. These are, these, like, am I plug super big in the video? Might look super big in the video, but it's actually really, really small. You know, it's pretty cool. Hmm. 
<clears throat> uh, so we did get it in. It was worked. It was successful. We did get it in. I, did good. I don't know if you could see this, so let me get a flashlight. It's a little dusty, you can see, but uh, you can see our memories in there. It's pretty nice. We did get it. We did get it to work. I just had to double check so I didn't mess something up. And now to our SSD. Our solid state drive. No. That's cool. All good stuff. So let's get to this So both of them did come with a sticker. They both came with a. They both came with a HyperX sticker. Pretty cool. Put that on my computer. Here's the SSD. No moving parts. That's what makes it really fast. Makes it really fast. So now I'm just putting these connectors. SSD. So I'm guessing since our motherboard was made was made almost like three years ago, it doesn't have a, another SATA port. It only has two. I'm guessing another one was taken out by the SD card. So this this cable. This cable right here, I don't know if you can tell. This cable right here, there was no, there was no other cable for another power thing to plug it in. So for now, we plugged in the memory, which I almost messed up. Hopefully, I didn't. Hopefully, I didn't mess it up. Hopefully, we didn't mess it up. Mission failed. We'll get them next time. When this video is posted, we will have the HyperX. 3D for 240 gigabytes DDR4 in. So yeah, that's it for that's it for now. So that was a little bit of a fail, but you know, I mean like. Uh, like I don't know. I just we'll get some new. Uh, we'll get another like. Uh, I'll get another part and we'll finish the video, but till then, couldn't have sat. So yeah, that's it for me now. Peace out.